Yo, what's good people? It's Jay Cactus, and in today's video, I've got something special today because I'm collaborating with my guy Chucky Beats. So Chucky's made me a fire fire melody and I need to cook up a beat using it. So shout out to Chucky Beats, man. He's a go and he's one of the people that inspired me to start a YouTube channel. So for me to now collaborate with him on videos and do a podcast together, it's just mad. So Chucky, much love, my bro. You definitely killed my loops. I need to do the same with yours. So I'm going to show you all Chucky making the loop and then I'll get straight into it. What's up YouTube? Today I'm making a melody for Jay Cactus. Shout out Jay. You totally, totally, totally killed the melody you sent me. So today I'm gonna need to, you know, do the same. Alright, so I'm gonna start off with this piano. Uh, it's an octave preset, uh, number 23, Piano Patience. Ooh, I like that. this out like this and let's just strum these first notes so all this Ooh, that's it that's it So let's put a vinyl effect on that. Super fire. Let's already create like a desampled version of that. So let's consolidate it. Open an audio editor. Write this. A thousand resampling. This. <laughs> Let's create like a reverse melody of this. Let's put Super VHS on the top melody. Like this, maybe let's solo it first. See what it sounds like. Fire. Maybe let's add some reverb. Not sure what it's gonna sound like, but maybe it's fire. Background melody, let's try and play it with the keys. Maybe let's put drip on it. This is super fire, bro. I'm super excited to see what you're gonna make with it, Jay. I'm sorry for making you a melody this mellow, but it's just like, I just felt like doing it, so let's fucking go. Uh, maybe I'm just put some uh, vinyl on the master and, and then send it over to you. So, hey, take care, much love. Thank you so much, love you guys, bow. Chucky, bro, this melody is crazy. It's real vibey. I was tempted for a minute not to make a drill beat, but now I'm thinking I wanna make some kind of army drill. I'm gonna keep it real smooth, but I'm gonna add drill drums. And we might as well use some sounds from the new kit I'm working on. I think this one. You know what? I might leave a lot of open space in this one. Just keep it real simple. And for the hat, maybe a counter snare. This one's sick. I'm gonna keep the pattern somewhat basic. Because it's quite a vibey track, I don't just wanna fill out everything with hats and perks and go crazy. I wanna keep that space. I 
And you know what? I might bring down the speed just a little bit. Maybe to something like 46. And you know what, I've got a reverb on the snare, but I'm gonna send that to a bus just so I can add the hats to it as well so they get the same effect. All right, so I wanna try a different snare, maybe this one. Yeah, I think that one works better. So now for the 808, I've been working on so many, including variations of the infamous fat and wide. Maybe this one for now. I think that 808 is sounding a little bit deep, so I'm gonna pitch the melody up like maybe like three semitones just so I know both the 808 notes are gonna sound right. Yeah, I like the sound of that. All right, I think that eight weight pattern sounding hard. As always, I'll be making a few different patterns, but this is the main one. Let's get some perks in there. Maybe this. So I just added those couple extra hi-hats just to help with the bounce right at the end. And uh, like I said, I don't really want to overdo this beat, but I am hearing some vocals and a riser. They're the only other things that I'm hearing right now. So I'm going to add them in and then go from there. You know what? Just as I was trying to find some vocals, I kept hearing this piano melody in my head. So I'm just going to lay this down quick. And I think I only want this in one section, but I'll record it in and see when I start arranging it. Yeah, I think this one fits the vibe a bit more. It's like a Rhodes piano. Sounding real vibey. 
But whenever I use Arcade, I feel like I have to do something to it, even though it sounds good. I don't know why, but I need to chop it up or something. So I'm just going to render this out and then see if I can play with the chop, maybe reverse a few things or just rearrange it. Yeah, and then maybe this one, just have this ending like this. Sounds crazy. So I've just done a few chops there. I've reversed this section and then added this to the end, just so it transitions nicely. Sound is sick. All right, I've definitely got enough of the beat now. I just need to mix it, arrange it, come up with a few different eight weight patterns, and then I'll show you the outcome. All right, so I finished mixing and arranging the beat. And honestly, this is one of the best beats I've ever made. I think the mix between that mellow vibe that Chucky made and then my drill drums just works perfect. So I'm just gonna play it and then talk you through it all. So I've just kept the intro the same. And then introduce the vocals. So I'm just gradually introducing things. My favorite part here. That little gap, that pause is sick. So we come to the verse here. Just gets a little bit more mellow here. And then the piano I've added. Then the vocals again. And that same pause. And then I've added this bit here, where his bridge was. Or I've added the synth bass as the bridge, should I say. So this section here is the hook. So you can hear I've done a few different eight weight patterns. Back to the verse. So it's real mellow, nice and vibey, but the drums are still knocking, there's still some bounce, and I think that combination just works. So Chucky fam, thank you for the melody. I think we killed that one. So I hope you liked the video and I hope you were feeling the beat. And if you haven't seen the video of me making the melody and Chucky Beats killing it, then that video is over on his channel. So make sure you go follow him on Instagram. It's Chucky Beats with a Z because someone stole his name. And for me, it's J Cactus Music because someone stole my name. But yo, thanks again for watching and I'll see you next time. Thank you.